watch the Cosumnes River. Of course, this is where we had a lot of the issues with the New Year's storm and all the rain that fell upstream. If you remember, we had eight to 10 inches of rain that fell in the foothills. And of course, that drains down through Sacramento County, through Deer Creek and the Cosumnes River. At this point, and a newly updated forecast out of the River Forecast Center as of 2.30 this morning, keeps that crest below 13 feet. And that's three and a half feet lower at the Michigan Bar site prediction than what we saw over New Year's. So not as much water likely going to be infiltrating the Cosumnes River this go around. Again, this is just the latest prediction. It all depends on just how much rain falls into the foothills. So what is expected in the foothills? Well, as we go through the day today, the valley picking up about an inch of rain in most spots. The foothills about an inch and a half of rain in Placerville, about an inch and uh, eight tenths. And as we go into tonight, we do see a lull. So I put this into motion all the way through Tuesday morning. We don't pick up that much rain after this morning and midday rain into tonight. In fact, it'll pick back up by tomorrow morning, likely at this time, and we'll start to add back to those totals. And in total, by the end of Tuesday, in the foothills, we could see two to four inches of rain. In the valley, we could see one to two inches of rain. Some spots, maybe even a little bit more. You can see Stockton and Modesto picking up anywhere from two to two and a quarter inches of rain, likely as we end the day on Tuesday. And still some residual showers may even linger on Wednesday. Again, this is just model predictions, something we're going to be updating you uh, throughout the morning and through the next couple of days, all eyeing those rivers as to how much rain falls, especially in the foothills. Over to you.